This is a self-help book published in 1936, which offers practical advice on how to improve your interpersonal skills and achieve your goals. The book is divided into four parts, each containing several principles that illustrate the main ideas. Part 1, Fundamental Techniques in Handling People. This part focuses on how to avoid conflict and criticism and how to encourage cooperation and appreciation from others. The three principles are, don't criticize, condemn or complain, give honest and sincere appreciation, and arouse in the other person an eager want. Part 2, Six Ways to Make People Like You. This part explains how to make a good impression and build rapport with others. The six principles are, become genuinely interested in other people, smiled, remember that a person's name is to that person the sweetest and most important sound in any language. Be a good listener and encourage others to talk about themselves, talk in terms of the other person's interests, and make the other person feel important and do it sincerely. Part 3, How to Win People to Your Way of Thinking. This part teaches how to persuade and influence others without offending or arguing with them. The 12 principles are, the only way to get the best of an argument is to avoid it, show respect for the other person's opinions and never say you're wrong. If you are wrong, admit it quickly and emphatically, begin in a friendly way. Get the other person saying yes, yes immediately. Let the other person do a great deal of the talking. Let the other person feel that the idea is his or hers. Try honestly to see things from the other person's point of view. Be sympathetic with the other person's ideas and desires, appeal to the nobler motives. Dramatize your ideas and throw down a challenge. Part 4, Be a Leader, How to Change People Without Giving Offense or Arousing Resentment. This part shows how to lead and motivate others effectively and positively. The nine principles are, begin with praise and honest appreciation. Call attention to people's mistakes indirectly. Talk about your own mistakes before criticizing the other person. Ask questions instead of giving direct orders, let the other person save face. Praise the slightest improvement and praise every improvement. Give the other person a fine reputation to live up to. Use encouragement and make the fault seem easy to correct. And make the other person happy about doing the thing you suggest.